Balthazar and the Gobbledygook. <clears throat> this video is not intended for children. They still talk about it. The one day in town when a blob monster came and vored everyone around. Jesus Christ. It was Balthazar's fault. He created the beast. But let me tell you the story of the Gobbledygook's feast. Balthazar was in his room, doing a science task, when two compounds mixed and oozed out of its flask. It was green, it was thick, it was slimy, and what's more, it was very, very hungry as it leaped out the door. Balthazar took it to a scientist friend, but the gobbledygook swallowed him up. He tried to warn the other scientist, but it swallowed them up too. He asked three gay firemen for help, but it swallowed them up too! He requested help of four gamer friends, but it swallowed them up too! He recruited five surfers, but it swallowed them up too! He sent six jocks upon it, but it swallowed them up too! Balthazar had enough and called seven Patreon supporters. How specific. But it very easily swallowed them up too. Finally, the gobbledygook oozed toward Balthazar. And it swallowed him up too. Are you very curious what happens next? Do you want to know what occurs in this text? You can download an ebook or purchase a copy. This is a real book with five more pages, quite sloppy. Now I'll close out this end card. There's not much to say. Enjoy the rest of what we call Vor Day. <laughs> you know, you honestly, once you finish talking about this, you really hope that everything else in the world rhymes afterwards. <laughs>